Ciao a tutti ragazzi, bentornati sul canale Dunque, sono atterrato su New Atlantis Nel sistema solare di Alpha Centauri Per proseguire con la storia principale Ora, sono arrivato lì sul, sul porto, diciamo E devo far notare che io sto giocando con una scheda video Che è l'RTX 3060 Normale a 12 giga 12 GB di RAM C'è un'altra nave che parte e un microprocessore che è un i9 9900K quindi di nona generazione adesso siamo a, ad oggi nel 2023 siamo alla tredicesima generazione quindi per il momento sembra andare molto fluido con un dettaglio medio alto ve lo faccio vedere questi sono i dettagli che ho messo qualità ombre media tutto personalizzato ovviamente tutto alto alto densità della folla media sfruttura di movimento assolutamente no Occlusione ambientale alta, qualità erba alta, ombre di contatto media, senza V-Sync e l'FSR2. Quindi, tutte queste voci dove si parlava che con la 3060 non si gira. Ora vediamo come si comporta nella città e aggiungo, a chi criticava 3060, di guardare il mio video dove, dove, la, dove la recensivo. Più che altro con, con lo spacchettamento. Quindi rivediamo un po, di, un po' di cose che parlavano di 20 fps in full HD in modalità alta. 28 fps si parlava. Quindi dai ragazzi, per piacere, questo non mi sembrano 28 fps o 30 fps. Dai, su. Comunque, continuiamo, parliamo col tecnico. E qui è il nuovo capitano. La mia crew può prendere un'occhiata al tuo ship. E puoi andare a trovare un trade authority kiosk se hai bisogno di offloadare un cargo. Dove hai detto che posso vendere la roba? C'è un chiosco accanto alla mia postazione, poco più in là rispetto alla rampa. Oltre a questo, c'è un mercantile, un negozio più vicino e tratta un po' di tutto. Ah, tre checkpoint di sicurezza. Perfetto. Dove posso creare altri. Ah, dove posso cercare altri membri per l'equipaggio della mia nave? Io porto. Lo trovi sulla sinistra appena arrivi. Perfetto. E ci va, non con cazzo di parola la nave. Va benissimo così. Tutto a posto, se hai bisogno di me, mi trovi al mio chiosco. Ovviamente mi sono tolto il casco perché Questo è uno della sicurezza Bevande Security checkpoint You will be scanned Io che di città, avanzare prego, va bene Guardate ragazzi Guardate che grafica nei dettagli puoi andare, buona permanenza. Guardate che roba. Guardate che roba. Come gira bello fluido. Io non so se siamo a 30 fps o 40 o non so 60, forse 60... No, però ragazzi. Oh. Tanta roba, eh. Ah, devo prendere la metro? Prendiamo la metro. Vai, 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 vai. The net. The net. It provides free transportation throughout the city. We can take it okay. directly to the mass district. Va bene. quartiere commerciale. Andiamo lì, quartiere. Dove dice la storia principale. Poi vedere, venderemo un po' di cose. Eccoci. Cioè, ok, vediamo adesso. Molto meno impegnato Direi che Sembra girare abbastanza fluido Ok Cambiato colore eh? L'acqua è molto gradevole New Atlantis relies on advanced hydroelectrics For most of its power allora, dove devo andare? La sicurezza. Sì, c'è un calo di frame rate, ovviamente, per la quantità di dettagli che c'è qua, però... Però, ragazzi, c'è cioè, abbastanza gradevole, eh. Qui la la loggia. Se non si loggia, mi tira a trovare te la porta in ingresso dove devi aprirsi. Va bene. Ok. Perfetto. Ok. 
Entra na biblioteca. Captain, everyone will be in the library, just inside. If Barrett were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now, and he will make this place your home. This is bello. Modulo, modulo leme dell'Apollo. Che bello. Che figata. No! Che cazzo faccio? Porco due! Ho sbagliato! Ho sbagliato il tasto! Invece di F ho schiacciato il tasto per lanciare la bomba, porca miseria! Up. Ah, bene! Dono! Welcome to Constellation! We have a lot to talk about. Oh. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? Eh, c'è da fare. C'è da 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 da fare. C'è Mm. Mm. Very well. This is a private privata delita l'esplorazione dello spazio e in primo luogo ma anche dell'anomalia dei sistemi colonizzati. Dobbiamo fare delle domande. Then we tend to have questions. Speaking of which, where is Barrett? Dove è Barrett? I pirati ci hanno attaccato. I see. Vasco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Fatti uh, reali. This is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. He's here with the artifact. Thank you, Matteo. Now. Let's focus Matteo. on what's in front of us, shall we? What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? Chi altri ha avuto queste visioni? We think it's anyone else who pulls one out of the rock for the first time. Why? We're not sure yet. So if you wouldn't mind adding another data point. Interesting. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience with Come this embellishment. Do ascoltare la loro riunione. concentrarci un momento? Vabbè. verificare la tua teoria. Right. Let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. Mm. The pieces we already have move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this new one to the two we already have, the artifact. If you could place it on the table here. Okay, posizioniamolo qua. That's it. Just like the <coughs> Come tutti gli altri. Perché all non ce ne fossero solo due. Oh my god, that's it. Whoa. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. That energy that's arcing between them, no manufactured material in the settled systems can do that. None of them. Whoa. This proves Easy that. girl. Breathe. You'll have a heart attack. She's not the only one. If they're coming together, that means there's a set. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, Patrick? You're on, Walter. Well, if we had all the answers, it wouldn't Dovrei be exciting. Non sarebbe eccitante, no? Now, would it? Not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend? Mandate la Barrett, va bene. <laughs> so, are you ready to get to work? Mandate il lavoro di vedere se l'esplorazione può essere la tua ragione di vita in questo nostro piccolo universo? Mettiamolo piccolo. Cosa avete mai fatto? They're just odd hunks of metal. Another oddity from the uncharted reaches of space. Sarebbe proveniente dallo spazio profondo inesplorato. As to what they are, what they're building. Cosa la formano? Beh, la risposta a questa domanda ora passerà anche a te. You're part of solving that puzzle now. 
We're all here because we're committed qui sono to exploring space. Diritti della esplorazione dello spazio umanità colonizzato stelle, ma questo non significa che abbia che debba cessare di lanciarsi nell'ignoto. Beyond that, you'll be expected to use your own judgment, just like the rest of us. Ah, oh, va bene. You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members are here, but you'll meet them soon. Come find me when you're ready. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, we're Eh, figo, ha dato il jackpot. Va bene. Figo. Hey. Parla con Sara. As much as I love uncovering new questions, I wouldn't mind if you could answer them. That was intense, wasn't it? The artifacts, I mean. Sorry, this will be a little overwhelming for you right now. I guess a lot overwhelming now that I think about it. I'm Noel. It's really nice to meet you. Yeah, you know what? And thank you for bringing the artifact to us. The artifact. Artifact. Però mi ha detto che c'è posto per me. Sembra di sapere molto su questi manufatti. Tu lo te cos'era la visione che ho avuto? If we were approaching this rationally, I suppose we'd call them visual and auditory hallucinations. What you perceived as lights and music could be overloaded neurally, but your brain's attempting to make sense of it. Something, an energy surge, some kind of phenomenon, or some kind of phenomenon. Or some kind of phenomenon. Or some kind of phenomenon. At the time, well, it's Barrett. We weren't sure if he was kidding around. Clearly, he wasn't. Che cosa abbia visto? Sentito niente. Quindi c'è una spiegazione razionale. There might be a reasonable explanation. I wasn't there. Non c'era, non ho visto ciò che hai visto tu. Non sono. I'm just not in a position to say for sure. That's okay. Now that this has happened to both you and Barrett, we can know to maybe expect it in the future. Be a little more prepared. We're all in this together now, right? How long have you been working? Well, Constellation's been around forever, more than fifty years now. But we only became aware of the artifacts recently. Barrett discovered the first one about two years ago, right under our noses, and he was the one who got this all in motion. It's a shame he isn't here to see this. Planning on sticking around then? Good. I think we can find a spot for you. And along the way, I can give you the very abbreviated tour. Oh, there's the one, dude. Oh, gosh. No, I mean, that's that's flattering. But really, we're making this up as we go. Until you arrived, we only had the two. And the vaguest sense that there was something more at work. There's still so much we don't know, and that means a lot of work ahead of us. Incentrato. Of course, there's plenty of planets out there that no one has ever set foot on, and everything we learn about them is valuable. We have a board where we post anything specific we're looking for, a type of alien flora, fauna, or a planet with a specific quality, like if it's a planet with life but doesn't yet. Well, right now nothing's off the table. Metallurgical analysis, chemical composition. I'm looking at everything. One thing I'm really trying to improve is my overall database of xenobiology. I don't know if it will help in this case, but the more we know about, well, everything, the better off we are, right? Speaking of, if you're going to be out there looking for more artifacts, you're bound to come across some interesting specimens. Anything organic, I'd be happy to take it off your hands. Che modo del televisore se vogliamo potrebbe aiutarci a sapere più se meno farti. I can't be certain that they will, but more data points are always a good thing. I don't want to rule out anything that could provide a breakthrough. And if it sweetens the deal, I can pay. Pretty well, too. Walter's pockets may not be bottomless, but they are pretty deep. Stay safe, okay? Stay safe. Bene. Allora, parliamo con Sara, va? So, are you ready to get to work, or was there something else? Ci sono questioni in sospeso. Ho ancora bisogno di un po' di tempo per ambientarmi. I don't know what you've heard, but I can imagine. First of all, 
I think you can dismiss any stories about us no longer existing. Hmm? I don't believe in smearing our name everywhere we can. Exploring the universe, Exploring the charting the unknown, that's what Va counts. Bene. Besides, having a little mystery gives us room to maneuver. A fixed reputation could fence us in a lot of ways. Not much, but you've seen them for yourself. It doesn't take a lot to realize we're dealing eh, with something questa. extraordinary. Just what that is, we'll have to figure out. It's what we do. È tutto pronto. We're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work. The artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock. Relativamente inert. That means people can pass them around, not even knowing what they are. Non ha senso stare troppo. I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually. But a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. A volunteer force that helps defend the edges of the United Colonies. They're always looking for recruits. Lots of retired veterans and dangerous professionals mixed in with part-timers who barely have a laser cannon welded to a hull. My contact is in the recruiting office, so he hears a lot about what the volunteers are up to. Ci sono altri in possesso di manufatti? We have to assume that we're not the only ones to have stumbled into this mystery. But most people aren't going into space looking for the unknown. They're looking for places to settle, resources to extract, territory to defend. An odd looking rock or a single strange hunk of metal wouldn't mean much to them. That's why Constellation exists in a way. To put pieces like this together. You've done this before, eh? Wise words. If we watch each other's backs, we'll be fine. But it's not just that. I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself. And for you to learn more about us. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. Il tuo seguace. Vediamo. We'll need to head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. Ufficio recrutamento della Vanguardia. And listen. Whatever you were before or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doorstep. Every member of okay. Constellation is their own conscience. Understood? Those are the rules. Advance humanity's knowledge to the best of your ability. As long as you do that, I'm not here to judge you. Now, let's you and I get over to Mast. Prima non essi al tuo equipaggio, se non ho ancora... Da ora in poi fa parte del tuo equipaggio. Ah. Figo. I know everyone's excited by the artifacts, but we need to be as objective as possible. It's almost as if you think I'm made of credits. What is it this time? Artifacts won't find themselves, and us going after them. Carbonate, reparare navi, pagare questo, pagare quello. Good thing you've got me around, Ms. Morgan. 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 Good Gestisci il tuo equipaggio, puoi esaminare e modificare l'assegnazione dei compiti di ciascuno tra nave e avamposti. Ciascun membro presenta delle, delle abilità differenti in grado di migliorare le prestazioni della nave o degli avamposti. Perfetto. Perfetto, l'ho assegnato alla nave. Ok, fantastico. Ok, andiamo dove dobbiamo andare. Vai. Ah, siamo usciti da quel posto, dobbiamo andare a parlare con questo tizio qua. Ah, siamo arrivati nel posto dove dovevamo andare con Sara, quindi ce la portiamo dietro. Andiamo piano, adesso corriamo. Giona. Welcome to Mast. If you have an appointment, you may proceed inside. Ok. If you don't have official business, we ask you remain in the lobby. Stay safe. Va bene. Ah, quindi qua posso chiedere dei lavori da fare. Beh, interessante. Ok, andiamo. Sarah, good to see you. Who's your friend? Hopefully Constellation's newest member. Thought I'd run through some legwork together. Ah, another space explorer. Hey, you ever think of joining up with the Vanguard? Help the United Colonies earn some credits? Even get your UC citizenship? 
Non parla di stelle piuttosto che combattere guerra. Allora, ma guardia. Fate volontari. Fai lavoro e crediti. Grazie. Non forget, John. I need him back after you wrap him in that fancy get-up of yours. No worry, Sarah. I'm not forgetting about you or our little business afterwards. Promise. First things first. Head down to the orientation hall. Get signed up at the registration terminal. System will walk you through the rest. Oh, and if you got a bounty, well, you're gonna have to make things right with the UC. Quindi in teoria faccio parte anche di questo. But if you've got any questions, I can get you sorted. The process starts with registration down in the orientation hall. Did you have a question? Sure thing. What do you want to know? Just hop into the elevator. You want the button for Vanguard Orientation Hall. Register yourself at the terminals in the lobby and the exam system will get you to where you need to go. Vanguard work is as needed. When we've got jobs, we'll make them available to you. But the work itself, well, it runs the gamut. Sometimes you might be hunting down hostile ships on behalf of the UC Navy. Ah, pure. Catch a navy pure. Or you might be called up to help the science division clean up some invasive species. Hell, we've even been asked to help take on the occasional terramorph. And sometimes we just need cargo support. Not every job's glamorous. The Vanguard only gets called in for the ones where there's a chance of seeing action. Wherever the UC needs us, the Vanguard is there. Okay. For the exam, we'll be putting you through a combat flight simulation. Let us see your piloting skills. Evaluate how you behave under pressure. All that will be risky to you and you're firmly getting blown out of an airlock. For the probationary mission, though, we'll be sending you out on the job all on your own. The specifics of the mission vary by what's available at the time. But we're not about to ask you to storm a Crimson Fleet base or whatever. At least, not on mission one. More likely you'll be making a drop off to some UC citizens in an area that's outside normal naval patrols. There'll be a risk of hostile contacts, but that's far from guaranteed. The exam's just a simulation. Only way you'll be hurt there is if you trip on your way inside. Now, for the probationary mission. We select those specifically to ease you into the type of work you'll be doing here. Make sure you're capable of handling things on your own. But I can't promise it'll be risk free. The UC sends us on jobs because there could be combat. This mission would be no different. Now, if that's a deal breaker, I won't be offended if you walk away. But this is the military. A chance of conflict is kind of in the job description. Huh. I'll keep an eye out for your results. La faccio parte io o dell'altra? What can I do for you, applicant? Mass is short for Military Administrative and Scientific Triumvirate. Oh. From here, the three co-equal divisions of the UC government work together to advance the cause of the colonies. Be that through mutual defense, political and diplomatic strength, or scientific discovery. Now, serving any of the UC's divisions grants citizenship, but scientific and admin positions in the UC tend to be real competitive. Understandable. Most people will prefer to earn their citizenship behind a desk rather than in combat. Not something I'd ever choose for myself, but understandable. Huh. Military used to have a pretty narrow view of where the best pilots came from. In their eyes, it was UC or bust. The creation of the Vanguard was an acknowledgement by the brass that maybe not all the galaxy's greatest pilots went through a UC flight school. So it's the Vanguard's job to find them. And get them to fly for us. Me, six, seven years now, was a recon squad commander in a former life, so it wasn't too big a jump bossing around foreign pilots instead. But Vanguard's been a quality assignment: meet new people, judge them on a series of diverse criteria, get them out there helping people who need it. Right. Got so wound up bringing you on board, I almost forgot. No, I haven't. 
Come on, John. Let's hear it, before you try to convince him to join the Marines. All right. Here's what I've got. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol oh. system? Which Admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Where is he's got some man. fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description Sarah gave me. Oh, he goes way back. He was recruit number 81 or something. Momento, cosa il sistema solare che non va? You kidding? Lowest posting request rate in the whole fleet. Esatto. Only thing there the UC cares about is Mars. E Marte. Non solo vuole andare su Marte, la gente se vuole andare da Marte. Perché? Se li potevo vedere. What? No. Soul system is as quiet as a cough. Perché? Ah, bene. A posto, sì. That means it's not going to be fine. I'm sure you two can handle it. Soul system is a lot of planets. But a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. Oh, but dimmi, eh, cosa Moara ha detto da aver trovato questo suo ornamento? You'll have to ask him. But Vanguard volunteers have retrieval rights if they get into a scrap. Wouldn't be surprised if he found it off of a pirate or something like that. So, but dimmi, sei donna? Yeah, bring a coloring book. You get so used to seeing red, you'll forget what blue is. Tanto lo senti il verde, presto come sono fatti il verde e il blu. Bueno, spazio forte, mi ricorda che. Definitely a lifestyle, burning helium out there, seeing where the stars take you. Ok. Poi? Ok, da quella parte. Andiamo. <coughs> spazio porto. L'ho lasciata là. <ride> Ciao, eh? I've flown across ah, most of the settled no. systems in all manners of spacecraft, and yet I still get sick on the nut. Ta. 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 200 metri. Ok. Rallentare perché se si corre tanto con un enorme peso di roba diventa un problema. Però puoi scaricare queste cose e poi venderle. Quindi va bene la missione, ma poi devo vendere tutti gli oggetti che ho. Ma ah, qua c'è Vasco. Vai. Good day, Captain. No, no. Vai, qua c'è Vasco. Sali a bordo. Andiamo. Yeah. Saliamo sulla... La postazione di comando. E vai. Decollo. Perfetto Vai così Eccoci qua Ok Sistema solare 273.000 anni luce Ok quindi Vai Vai col salto gravitazionale Wow Oh, eccoci su Marte. Sta scansionando. Non è contrabbando, perfetto. Vai, a terra. Ah, bene, se terra su Marte di notte. Wow Perfetto, mi sa che devo indossare il casco prima di scendere Adesso questa è idonea Eccoci Anche Sara si è messa la tuta, buono Hello, Captain Bene, ciao Vasco Ah, dobbiamo andare lì. Eccoci qua, a Saidonia. 
Stava un posto su Marte. Non so da che parte. Vai. Dunque, questo filmato va bene, va bene così, è tutto. Proverò un altro video dove si fa l'esplorazione su Marte, cerco di trovare qualcosa e scansionare il pianeta rosso secondo Starfield. Bene, al prossimo video, ciao a tutti!